Right now, at-home COVID test kits are all the rage. We know the federal government started out mailing out four free kits to many American homes, if you ask for them, right? Testing lines are getting longer and longer. But there are a lot of people who are getting false negatives. Tonight, Evan Kozlov verifies how you can avoid that problem. As of January 15th, all private health insurers are now required to reimburse Americans for the at-home test that they buy. So a lot of Americans may be testing themselves for the first time. And Verify is here to make sure that you have all the vetted information when you need it. So let's verify. What are some of the most common reasons for a false negative or a false positive, and how can you avoid them? We went to these three experts, Dr. Amish Adalja, Dr. Gigi Granval, and Dr. William Maurice. So what could cause a false negative? Our experts listed three things that could go wrong. The test was taken too early, and you're not infectious yet, but maybe soon. The test was taken too late, meaning you might have had it yesterday, but you're no longer infectious or the test was taken incorrectly when you think about the false negative it's really making sure you follow the package insert directions and get a good specimen false negatives are a problem for public health because if somebody is thinks they're negative and they're actually not and they might go on to infect other people because they're not you know people aren't are they're laying their guard down okay what about false positives false positives are rare they may have for example an expired test kit they may have done the test kit wrong and in those situations you may want to repeat it that's why those test kits come with two false positives are more of a problem just logistically in life so what can you do to make sure that you get a good sample and therefore an accurate test when it comes to rapid antigen tests i i always recommend people watch a video if they haven't done it before and that's our top tip for getting it right Companies like Abbott, which makes the Binax Now at-home test, have their own instructional videos. And if you follow the instructions to a T, you'll get your results in about 15 minutes. With your Verify, I'm Evan Koslow. Good to know. And if there's something you'd like us to verify, you can email us, verify at 12newsnow.com, or you can message us on one of our social media accounts.